Good morning. Okay. Can you guys share um, the live on Queensland group and some other desert rose group? They asked me to do some tutorial, but I cannot go live in all the groups. So if you can please, if you can please share, I will appreciate that. Okay, so what do we need? We need grafting tape. This is for flat graft and this is for our big graft. Can you please guys share in Queensland group and other desert rose group if you can please. And we are going to do to graft the um, this is galactic. I managed to get some I managed to get some root stock. Luckily, all right. How do I? So that is what I get today. So far. All right. I cannot turn my camera back. Hi Leanne, can you please share um, this live in Queensland group and other desert rose group? Because if I if I um, do live in Queensland, the other ones in the other group can see it. I put it um, it's on public, so it should be able to be viewed by everybody. Okay, what do we need for grafting is we need our our cuttings, of course. So, we have our cuttings and we are grafting the um, galactic and of course we need our rootstock. So, I'll just show quickly because some other people are asking me to do some tutorial but I do have some some video in Queensland group if you can still find them or someone can bump so we'll do the first thing we will need our marker so this is what I use I get all of this from eBay and we have our crafting tape i got this one from our local mitre 10 we have our uh for crafting tape for flat graph and i also have i also have this one here my friend uh, atelinda sent me this one but i haven't used this one yet i should try this actually it looks good I think it will be good in in um, uh, big grab okay and then we need hydrogen peroxide to clean our knife and our knife should be really sharp and clean but be careful not to be not to cut yourself and if you are going to be doing a lot of crafting you'll have to use some gloves because uh, long contact with hydrogen peroxide can burn your skin. Okay, we'll do some flat grab first. Yes, I'm going to cut my. 
cuttings so we only need this we only need this short we don't need too much with the flat grab that's a good thing with flat grab you can do so much and then you have to make sure that you cut that really nice and clean so can everyone see it and if you can see that middle part there that round part of the cuttings and that same part there the middle you just have to put them together so just connect them that way and we are going to use our tape for our flat grab and you just have to do carefully so the technique is you have to use your knife sharp and clean do it like that it's so hot here one I usually do my um, live tutorial in Queensland group but I have a few people that is on the other group and they can't see my life if I am doing it in groups so I'll do it in my own page and uh, just put it on public and it should be able to be viewed by people that is not on my friend list so that's our flat graph done and then we are just going to put our tags you can put your dates so dates today is um the third so i just put the way and done so that's how i do it so that's one flat graph done so i have a few to do we'll try to do i will show you how to do my How to do the big grab so if you are newbie big grab is easier to take than the flat grab with uh, from my own experience but then again like I said everyone have their own way of grafting some people use uh, glue some people use just the um, there's a they just tie it up with the strip but this is how I do mine. So again, cut clean. And we are going to do some big grab. So that's all we need for the big grab. That's how long. and we just have to expose that middle part if you if you get just the normal cuttings of uh desert rose and you cut you cut the the that part you will see there's like a, a different color in the middle so that's the part that you have to expose so that's what i did there just expose that one and my cuttings if there are still subs coming out you just have to cut 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 again and it will stop and then again make sure your knife is clean and some people when they do big wrap they will cut big wrap in the middle but with me I just I just cut this way and I don't take any more dramatic cuts in my cutting so that's the way 
everyone can see it yeah it don't have to be it, it all up to you if you wanted the the cuttings and your and your and your um root stock to be the same size but with me i don't i don't matter because the this one will grow your cuttings will grow and it will it will catch up with your root stock and then i'll just tie it up this way and that's the way there you go that's uh, our big grub so it just takes practice if it don't work the first time don't give up try it again trust me when i was starting i lost a lot of plants i killed a lot of plants before i get success and there was no one that is willing to share what they what they know about grafting and and growing so i just have to learn my own okay so we'll do another so it's all up to you how long your root stock but i want mine to be a shorter and that way once they are ready to go i don't have to worry about packing them and same thing that middle part there and the i don't know if you guys can see it it's hard to but anyway if you cut your cuttings or your rootstock you'll see that there's a round part in the middle it's a bit hard to put uh to put focus on it my camera is playing up and then you just have to connect them together again just be careful not to drop it otherwise you won't know which is which now and if you accidentally put your graph your cuttings upside down it it sometimes it grows sometimes it don't but it will take so long before they take or before the new the new growth and then again same thing it is so hot here go and we'll put another one uh Karen sometimes it's uh it depends with uh the weather where you are but because here in where i am is about it's hot here so usually at least two weeks two weeks you will see a new growth coming out i don't have any any at the moment because i they are all i took all the plastic out but it usually takes two weeks So again, same thing.
hydrogen peroxide you can message me if you have any question i'm more than happy to help i get my hydrogen peroxide at our local chemist so you can get this one the chemist and that is another one done I have to do quite a few today. Brandon, you can share the uh, this live to your group and to other group because I have quite a few members that's asking me to do some tutorial, but I cannot. I cannot do it all at once in so many groups. So you can share. All right, we'll clean our knife again. If you have any question, you can message me or you can comment below. same thing once you get used to it you'll be expert So I am grafting galactic uh, on a medium size. Once they are ready, they are going to be $60 each. So if you want to put your reservation, you can message me. We had like all night rain last night, but it's so hot today. So I don't have to water my plants. You can share in your groups, no problem. I sugar. Hi, honey, Lou. Karen, yes. So if your if your rootstock grow new branch and you leave it, then you'll have two colors, two colors in one plant. I have here nineteen and twenty one colors in one plant.
Ate Linda, kumusta ka na? Miss na kita. Hi Wendy. Good morning. Yes, Karen, amazing. Hi. I have like different I think I have I oh I have two I have grafted one I can't remember what's the color but I think it's melting heart and the uh, night shadow in one plant that will look amazing when it flowers I'll put it for sale So, whoever knows about night shadow and melting heart, I put them in one plant. And it will be available for sale probably in another two weeks. I haven't posted yet. Okay. I already grabbed seven pieces with that short cuttings. The flat I prepare flat grab because I can do so much in that small piece of cuttings. You're welcome, Cheryl. Oh, Brandon, it's your turn to do some tutorial next time. And you're getting better with your hand pollinating as well. Actually, we'll try to, I'll try to show you how to hand pollinate today. It's a bit hard because it's only me. My son is on holiday. I have no one here and fiance is not here as well. So I'm all alone. Hi, Pcel. Yeah, I haven't slept yet. I will sleep maybe after lunch. I'll have lunch first and then I sleep like straight. I've been to the nursery already. <laughs> I was the first one there.
I'm grafting this into the pink desert rose. So this is all we need for the flat brush. Skips me away from trouble. Sell. I shit sugar. Sorry. See, sometimes, sometimes it will not hold properly. Yes, you just have to put it down and tie it up shut up no come here shut up leave it That's one more. We have so much to do. Shut up. Oi, leave it. Come on. My dog is so unfriendly. Can you share this one in the uh, Queensland group, please? How many flowers did you open today? Did you have brain where you are, Carrie? Yeah, what you been doing? I'm sure you've been poking some flowers this morning. Right. I'm not surprised. I am not surprised at all.
That's a good right. I have so many siblings, I'm telling you now. And I have a lot of seeds that just came. Imagine that. I sugar. Yeah, I always buy my seeds from Yang Bing. Good germination. And I get better color. Hi, Christine. Did you get the seeds? You will never stop really, like, I do the same. I'm having anxiety when I don't have, when I don't have, um, seeds coming for the whole week. Really bad. No, actually she's getting better. I'm so proud of her. Leanne is the one. Where's Leanne? She should do some crafting tutorial again. No, Carrie is getting better. She'll need to do some 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 tutorial for us soon and the post office said that uh there will be some delays because of holidays so others some others said they already got it on friday but um you probably will get it next week or this coming monday or tuesday hopefully Is she watching? Hi, Leanne. Oh, she's so funny. And Christine. Yeah, sometimes they can be, they can be annoying. Okay, that's another one done. I wish I'm closer with so far. Imagine the one the the last one that you guys did. It it actually take that blue method. The bloody thing. <laughs> Hi Jen. Good morning.
I will be I will be um I will be trimming some of my some of my my collection so I'll send some cuttings to I'll send some cuttings to um Susan I got yours, Jen. I already have new branches and new leaves. But I'll give it another, probably another two weeks, three weeks. I shush. See, now it falls. I don't know which is the... I have to get another one. Sometimes it can be tricky. I still have to do the um, quad Santa, but now I, I just have uh, I just I just picked up some rootstock, so I'll be doing I'll be able to do it today or tomorrow. It's getting too hot here. We have rain all night. And then today it's probably another 40, 40, 42 degrees. It's just shitty weather. Okay. Yeah, we are not, humidity here is not too bad, but it's just dry heat. It's just so hot that you can cook eggs on the street. Just keep on practicing, Carrie. You'll get it. You're getting better. You see, before you're not getting any, any success. And then lately. Lately, you have a few. My hand is shaking today. Oh, I just put down your name when you say, oh, I want this one. I just put your name. So I don't even know what you ordered. When I have some ready, I just check who ordered it. And, and just message you. Okay. You'll get better. Keep practicing. Sugar. See, I keep on. What's wrong with me today?
I think I'm getting old. I get it from eBay. Victor. I get my grafting tape on eBay. This is the flat, the flat one. So you'll see on eBay there are different different prices and but they are using the same picture so i get the one i tried to get the one that was like three pieces for i think five dollars and it's just crap so you have to get the one the one like eight dollars for one piece Christine, uh, it depends what's available. I sell some 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 of my cuttings, but it depends with the availability. So the rare ones, the rare purple ones are fifty dollars, and the uh, others are twenty twenty up to thirty dollars. You can grab uh, from eight to ten flat grab. I don't know how many that is in inches, but you're welcome. Hold on, I'll just get some cuttings. I cannot do much uh, I cannot get much cutting because I hand pollinated my plants and uh, I have some seed pods coming look at this this is pink I have so many seed pods but these ones are Good morning, Ate Lilian. My God, my co-workers are all watching. I still have enough for a big crop. So I grafted um, 20 pieces of of um, galactic. Hopefully all of them will take. Probably not.
You'll get used to it, Gary. I've been doing this for years. That's why it, it seems like... Flat grab is easier and faster. Yay, we did 20. I still have some cutting, so I'll probably do more. Who's the lucky one that will get this fruit stock? It's double white. My God, sorry, <laughs> it scares me. Something fell off our roof. Okay, we'll do. Big wrap. So if you are grafting and and the cuttings have these buds, just leave it. Sometimes they will they will continue. Sometimes they won't. Well, for me, I leave it. And they might continue to flower. There you go, that's one done. We'll do one last. And then we'll see if we can do the uh, hand pollination.
Hi, Jem. Can you share it to the to Queensland group, please? Victor, this is hydrogen peroxide, six uh, percent. It's a bit hard. Six percent. You can, you can find one with a uh, three percent, I think, and I'm not too sure, but I always use the six percent. It doesn't matter. I don't think it matters what you use really so that's our big wrap a sugar Okay, so that's two big wrap done. I did so far 21 pieces of galactic. We'll see if they will all take. I will try to... Let's try to do some hand pollination. Just give me a sec. I'll get some... I have to get some flour to... Okay, oh, we're gonna do this one. I need to focus. So, I don't know how we're gonna do this, but we'll try. Okay, so we open this one. I use the I do, I use the chops the this what what toothpick, not chopstick, and then. When you open the flower, let's see, hold on. Mm. Uh, maybe. Okay. So, so if you open the flower, you'll see the receptacle the receptacle is this one here that long 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 so i'll show you the receptacle so this is the receptacle okay you guys can see it So that's the receptacle there. So when you get the pollen, you have to rub the, the pollen around that receptacle. So now we'll try to see if we can do... I'll get another flower. Give me a sec. Uh, Victor, it depends. Sometimes it will take like um, sometimes it takes two weeks, one week. So it all depends with the weather where you are. We'll see if this one will work. It's a bit hard because I have no one to do the video. I have to do it my own. So we open the flower. Of course, uh, let's imagine this is uh, still intact with the plant. So when you open the flower, you will see the pollen. The pollen is... You'll find the pollen just on top of the receptacle up here. So this one doesn't have much. 
you see this one this is the receptacle so if we open the flower like this and there will be pollen here the pollen is like a yellow or white powder so you you just scrub the pollen from there and you will grab you will rub it here you rub on that shiny area and that is the receptacle so you get the pollen from here and put the pollen up there okay and then after that one slowly put it back just slowly put it back and what i do is i put the uh, tape so let's imagine this is still intact inside in in on the plant and i put my tape around here so the water will not get in when i water my plants and there you go that's how it works and i'll show you some of my hand pulling that that i did and and actually works that's my garden so this is some i have two here and i have another one from this lot this is uh, indigo that one and i have some here this see that's that's i hand pollinated that one those ones with the plastic they are hand pollinated and see i have one here that already work see i have one there that's one there if you can see it it's hard to focus and i have one that is forming there so i have two seed pods and hopefully this one will work so it just take off hopefully this one will work and uh, looks like i have another one forming there so they are all hand pollinated but see this one it didn't work so it's all right if they don't work then try again and i have here i hand pollinated so the flower take off already looks like looks like i have two that works there so i have one here and one there i will find out after maybe another week another week or two and i have a few here some here that i had pollinated so i have i don't know yet if they work or if they don't i have some here so the tape is sign that i pollinated them and i have some here this is black beauty and i have seeds here and i have another seeds there so that is the black beauty that i hand pollinated and i have another one here this is also black beauty there and where's the others i have some here in front i have a really cool one three seed pods so this one here i have one here that is just forming see you can see the chops the 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 toothpick is still there not chopstick so and there is one there that is already have a bump so that surely did work and i have one here as well that works and here this is the coolest one see that's tripod three seed pods coming out there you go I hand pollinated that one and i have another one here so i have quite a few that i hand pollinated i still have to see this one here is just 
um, drying the flowers drying off but the uh, see this the receptacle looks like it it works so we'll see what happened you just keep on poking those flowers and you never know you might get some seeds and some here I hand pollinated some here but looks like nothing works we'll see oh it looks like that one works see there's one there so that's this flower I hand pollinated this one there yes we have one seed pod there so far coming and I have hand pollinated some here looks like nothing work up here so nothing there uh, this one here just take off so and this one as well I hand pollinated this so we'll have to we will not see it straight away so you have to wait for one week but if if the receptacle stay there this one then that's a good sign that it might work so that's it and that's the grafting that we did i have to put label label on them and continue with my grafting it's so hot so i will finish the live and hopefully it helps you guys can share in the groups uh, i put the settings on public so it should be able to be viewed by other people that is not on my on my friend list okay you have a good weekend everyone thank you for watching and see ya